I was in bed uh, and was trying to get up and realized I, for some reason I couldn't get out of bed. It just seemed like one leg just wouldn't move at all. So I just know there was something definitely wrong. I was a little late going downstairs, so I heard my wife call upstairs, where are you? And I think I mumbled something and she came up and the minute she came in the doorway, she knew exactly what was going on and got on the phone and called 911 and got with the ambulance crew. And very quickly, luckily, they were there. And we were able to discover that he had a stroke very quickly because we were alerted by EMS that he was having stroke-like symptoms of weakness and trouble with language. So when he came into the emergency department, we were able to do several types of CAT scans that we were able to determine, one, that he was having a stroke, and it was a large stroke with a big blockage in the brain, and two, that he had lots of areas of brain left that we could salvage. So the Medeiros family is with us today and, and they have an excellent story of when our system, our 911 system works right, when everything falls into place from the time help is needed, right, from, from the point we get to the hospital to the point later down the road where a patient comes home. It was kind of emotional to realize that these guys saved my life. Uh, and having no recollection of what they looked like or whatever, you know, it was, it was great seeing them. Recovery's been, been good. Uh, I think I slightly overplayed it for a while, saying that uh, I was fine, uh, because reading about stroke and reading about mine, I, I'm very lucky. But I do have, uh, I, I am tired more than I ever have been. Uh, walking has become a little harder than it was. I, I try to walk a couple miles a day, and I used to be able to do that in one walk. Now I have to break it up. Basically, I like to play in here. It's 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 fun. Uh, I do a lot of lathe work. I make the Moravian stars, which people kind of love. They gave me a lot of tasks to do in the shop, and it's taken a while to come back here to do some work. Not because I was physically. Incapable. I was kind of mentally. I didn't have. The, I didn't have the ambition. That tiredness seems, and I, I still fight that a little bit. I'm not my old self yet. I'm happy. I'm happy where I am, and that I'm. I'm very lucky. I'm very fortunate in every way. <laughs>